Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. Where do you sign a credit card? Imagine you've just received your shiny new credit card. Exciting, right? But wait, before you start swiping, there's a small task at hand, signing it. Yes, that little white stripe on the back is not just for show. This stripe is known as the signature panel. It's where you put your John Hancock. But why sign, you might ask? Well, it's all about security, my friends. Signing your card helps verify that it's really you using it. When you make a purchase, the retailer might check the signature on your card against the one on your receipt. No matchy, no chargey. It's a simple way to protect your hard-earned cash from fraudsters. Not signing your card can be a no-no. It could even mean your card is not valid. So grab that pen and get to signing. It's the final touch to make your credit card fully yours. Keep in mind, some merchants may not accept an unsigned card. So it's best to sign it as soon as you peel it out of that envelope. And hey, it's also a great way to practice your autograph. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning in to our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.